last uh, two, th two to three minutes of trade now. So let's wind down what has been a really spectacular session for the market. Uh, the market's now just a whisker away from reclaiming the levels where it was before we had the whole manic Monday yen carry trade storm hit us. Uh, well, so this is a powerful recovery, 400 points up. So let's take a look at uh, the leaders. Technology all the way, Wipro, Tech Mahindra, uh, TCS, HCL Tech. LTI mine tree. So the gains are stretching anywhere between 2% to 4, 4.5%. Beyond technology, some of the auto stocks have been really revved up today. Ola Electric, obviously, beyond the Nifty, is the stock of the day. Uh, takes all the applause over there with that 20% move. Uh, but on the Nifty, M&M, Tata Motors, uh, these are stocks that have had a good run. By the way, there's, uh, there's been uh, some profit taking on Maruti. Maruti didn't quite uh, hold up uh, like some of its other peers. Uh, the other part of the market that really supported the bulls was banking. So the Bank Nifty is ending with a gain of over a percent and a half. And a lot of the big constituents like ICICI Bank, HDFC Bank, all up uh, anywhere between uh, 1% to one and a half, two 2 percent So uh, all round green screen on the Nifty. And a near 2% rally on the mid and the small cap uh, index and closing the week on a winning note. Uh, so the mid cap and the Nifty index were higher by 0.7% for the entire week. Uh, outside of the, you know, the large indices, Ola Electric is clearly the stock of the day. 20% up a circuit on that. 133 in terms of uh, the last stick. Mid-cap IT names like Birla Soft, first source catch your attention. DLF posts the JP Morgan upgrade, zooms up 5.5%. And then you had strength in IEX, NBCC, Hindustan Copper on the way up. On the way down, Hindustan Zinc um, got a bit of a slam dunk, down nearly 10%. But with that, uh, we're going to um, wrap up uh, trade for the day, for the week. Thank you very much for watching this show. Don't go anywhere. Our uh, 